This is Reality Rap. Let's get into brand new episodes of Marriage Bootcamp Reality Stars, followed by My Life is a Telenovela. So this week's activity was messy. Listen, for everyone who will ever do a reality show, when they break y'all up into two groups, they put your man over here and you over there in another room, and they put you in a room full of other singles with a bunch of cocktails, you're being recorded. Michael, he avoided it. Margo avoided it. Everybody else, I don't know. You look so beautiful tonight. Thank you. What's your son? Pisces. Pisces. What are you? Do we get along? <laughs> Shut up. We clearly see that this week's meltdown moment went for it once again. Kiki, girl, when Kiki walked in that room, she wasn't even mad at him. She was mad at the girl doing the cheers, but she got mad at Michael for letting the girl do the cheers in front of him. Like, girl, it's a cheer. I used to want to be a can cheerleader, but I've never felt pretty can you enough. To me? Michael, I've never please felt pretty enough to talk. be a cheerleader, but so I was listen? a wrestler. But did anybody else hear that besides me? A wrestler, Kiki. Okay, I think we just need to go ahead and give a bed and charge rent to Storm right now because he's now in the doghouse for the second week in a row. What did you threatening her do for y'all relationship, Mike? You didn't hear nothing. Say something else about me or my club again, you clown. Say something about my club again, I dare you. Guess what, Storm, threats don't matter to me. Clown. Let's get into my favorite show right now. My life is a telenovela. So we pick up where we left off from last week. Liliana called security on CC, and it just went batshit crazy from there forward. I, I see you always angry. Me angry? Yes. I'm the, I'm the happiest I'm person you could ever meet. I'm no. barking and biting. It's like. I'm hey. advising you. Don't cross me again. I'm gonna kick her ass. Now, this is the shade, y'all. Cece's been throwing shade all season, and somebody finally threw some shade back at her. So Cece wants to audition for the role that she's already played before in the Spanish version of the film. And she needs to re-audition for the role. Please make me your, please have me for the last time. This, this is not right. I'm dating your own daughter, you know that. Gustavo was the perfect choice. We have so much chemistry. We have forgotten the camera is even there. I really want you. Have me. I want you inside of me. If Janelka gets to see this, I'm His wife, Janelle, already done walked up on uh, CC like, I got my eye on you, girl. Not too much. So this was my favorite part of the episode. Rockinelle gives us the breakdown of what makes a telenovela cat. Number one, you have to have a fierce stare down, honey. Two, you have to have a slap. Number three, you gotta have a little hair fling. Four, the chokehold. And number five, the infamous hair pull. Stop it! Ah, you mother man. Just another day at the office. Let's keep the social conversation going. Make sure you use the hashtag Marriage Bootcamp and My Life is a Telenovela. And as always, I'm Mr. Ray, your WeTV host, and you're watching Reality Rap.